the earth is called the blue planet do you know why let's find out good day children and welcome to today's evs lesson let us begin by reading a beautiful poem called water read it along with me water i'll wash my face with water said munna to his nanny we all quench our thirst with water we are all alive because of water water has been with us for ages its story can fill so many pages somewhere it is dew somewhere it is snow steam is also water as you know water has forms so many that is what says my nanny the river flow the waterfalls sing and water swells in lakes and springs life on earth it has brought watered fields and life they got but when the water breaks in floods great misfortune it always works a lovely poem that is telling us so much about water and how important it is to us Do you know any poem or song on water? Water is all around us. More than half of the earth's surface is covered with water. There are many natural sources of water such as lakes, rivers, seas and oceans. Man-made sources of water include dams and reservoirs these are called artificial sources of water water present in rivers lakes and streams is called fresh water and water present in seas and oceans is salty water in the poem we heard about the different forms of water they are solid that is ice liquid and gas that is steam rain is the purest form of water but too much of rainfall can cause floods while no rain at all can cause water shortage and drought in many places people face scarcity of water can you imagine even one day without using any water at all in the desert areas of rajasthan where water is very little people collect rain water in tanks or tankas water is precious it gives life to everything around it humans animals and plants all need water to live we should never waste water and always use it carefully